Welcome back. We are going to start chapter two now. A troll is as a troll does. So let's go ahead and get started. Huh? Like the way she just rubs her knuckles. She could be bleeding by now. So now that we have control once again, we can explore this uh, troll underground where she can look at herself in the mirror. <laughs> with a tongue, like worthy of Gene Simmons. And this is something that's very important. You need to look at this picture and notice what she says. Well, she won't say it this time, but if you notice before, the troll before had green eyes, and this guy has purple eyes. That's a little, a little hinky, isn't it? I think it's a little hinky. So, I don't really have much to do in here. Oh, my arrow turned blue, so because I'm playing Rosetta. This is the main room. Who are you, Miss Lee? You're no real troll. I can see right through you. What do you want, King Altar? You human minx? I don't want anything. I was just looking into this pool, and, and then I saw this... Baloney, little girl. You're trying to steal the throne of the underground. You surfer, you surfer! <laughs> It's a fun word. You so know. Why, you're no you surfer. You poor little thing. Don't cry. I didn't mean to be cross. It's just that King Otar has been so strange lately, and that a horrible woman has been snooping around. I'm not crying. Of course 
wish you're not here. Now you listen to me. I can help you turn back into a human. You can? Are you an enchantress? Well, not exactly. I'm a Tilda, and I used to be King Ultra's nursemaid when he was just in control. Anyway, I can give you a list of ingredients for a magic potion that will turn you back into a human just like that. But you have to do something for me. Anything. Well, there's a catch. Up above this kingdom is a dark black hole in the middle. Our kingdoms were never crazy about each other. We had a civil relationship. Now, because of her, the Ooga Booga Ice, attack any troll that shows a face above ground. Missy, once you're human, you will go above and investigate. I have a gut feeling that our kingdom is in terrible trouble. Of course I will, Matilda. Wonderful. Now listen, girl, bring me some baked beetles. Take a list of this. Water of emerald, a silver spoon, and a gold bowl. Got it? Got it. Stupid old toy rat! This is not what I wanted! I wanted a battle axe! Okay, so, um, yeah, I hope you're paying attention to that list of things you need to get. If you forgot something, um, you can always talk to Matilda. Is that her name? I forget what her name is already. Or is that the evil witch? I don't know. Anyway, you can just click on her and she'll tell you again. Uh, first things first, I'm going to pick up this rat that the little girl dropped. And then I'm going to come over here and grab this shield from the wall. And what we're going to do is examine the shield and take out this spike thingy. Okay? And then, let's see, what do I want to do first? Let's go get the beetles. No, that's not what the beetles are. They're up here. This is the kitchen up in here. Probably obvious because there's a dining table right there. You are so wonderful. You are the most beautiful stew in the world. All you need is a juicy bat or a tender rat. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Uh, you totally did it. Don't lie. You just call me a dreadful peasant? I will have you know I'm engaged to the Troll King. Okay, so that didn't go very well. Did anybody else notice that he just like picked that spatula up from off the floor and then used it again? That's gross. Revolting beast. Oh, I love her voice. It's perfect.
Might as well talk to them while we're in here, because I have to talk to them anyway. But who is that tall, imposing woman? Uh, her name is Malisha, and uh, to tell you the truth, lady, uh, no one really knows who she is. I know who she is. She's a fool. That's who. Shut your mouth, old god. You don't know nothing. Some girls say Malisha is an evil fairy, cast on an inferior up there in the clouds. I think that's all they say. Is there anything more you could tell me about Malisha? Uh, hello, lady. I'm yes, sorry. No, no way. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and leave. Oh, hold on, my mouse is acting funky again.